right, folks, I am back to my little abode here after our flooding, so <laughs> it's a little adventure there. Um, <coughs> I, I wanted to talk a little bit about, and, and you know, I want to, in this re short reflection, I wanted to encourage all of you to get to know, uh, and I did one on the ADA. The ADA is very expansive, so I'm sure um, I did only, you know, sections, uh, but the one I wanted to do is on the ACAA, which is the Air Carrier Act. Um, this is the one that helps us in airports, <laughs> and especially for those who um, have issues with their wheelchairs. So I think that one is, is important to get to know, and I'll do a separate video on that one because it's I want to put some details, some meat on it, so you can listen to it and be aware. I think that, you know, um, just being aware is, is important. It helps us. It gives us courage. It gives us guidance on what we need to do. So, um, so this is um, an important aspect, I think, on the ACAA. It is what helps us with airlines and airports and not the ADA. So sometimes people get those two confused. Uh, the ADA, you know, helps us elsewhere. Uh, but the ACAA, uh, the Air Carrier Act, um, really does hone into the issues, some of the issues we have with airlines and, um, and the airports. So I wanted to do a specific video on that uh, and, and read line for line, but not, not the whole paragraphs, but just, you know, the most important line in each, in each area so that you know that this is your right, that you know that this is where you are protected, and so... Uh, we will talk about when I'm when I'm looking at the ACAA with more detail. Then, then I will, you know, give some ideas and what people have done to resolve their their little conflicts here and there. But you know, I think that, and there's also a DOT list of your rights as a person with disabilities. So we'll also share that one, so that you know w what you know what rights do you have. You know, once you're on the airplane, they haven't taken you off. Your wheelchair is not there at the door. <laughs> the pilot says, "I'm sorry, but I have to turn this plane around, so you need to get off." And we don't have staff to help you get off. <laughs> so you're like, "What?" So. <laughs> You know, all these crazy things have happened to people with wheelchairs, and uh, we've heard the stories. Uh, you know, they've been all over the news, and they've been, um, they've been on the news here at YouTube, so, so they're no mystery for us. And a lot of people out there have had some good experiences, which is, which is really important because it shows, it shows that back and forth in there. The airlines uh, are trying and trying to do better with the wheelchairs, trying to do better in their service for us. So, um, so that's important also to see the positive. Uh, we've heard all the negative. <laughs> we've heard, you know, the big numbers and how many wheelchairs they've broken and all the disasters. But we also need to bring forward those people who have. Um, had good experiences and they felt that the airlines was really honest and supportive and their experience was was a good one so we also need to throw those in so that we know that it is possible to fly without a problem <laughs> so <laughs> so i don't want those people who have had positive experiences <laughs> to start to freak out <coughs> and think that, you know, the worst of the bad and the ugly is going to happen to them. No, if you had, a, you know, quite a few good experiences, that's good. Hold on to that. 
and um, I'm sure it will gradually continue to, to happen uh, for the rest of us. So, uh, so that's what I wanted to reflect upon today to know and let you know that the airlines are trying across the board. The DOT, uh, the Department of Transportation, for those who are not familiar with it, uh, those, those initials, here in the United States, we have the Department of Transportation, which is the overall uh, structure for airlines and trains and buses and all that kind of stuff. You know, everything that belongs in the, in the public realm. So um, everything that belongs to the transportation realm, let's put it that way. <laughs> so. So the DOT really has been talking with the airlines. The airlines have been talking with the DOT. So we have, <coughs> we have plans on how the airlines are gonna improve things. Uh, so that those who have had really bad luck, you know, can fly again and regain their trust in, in, in flying. And that their wheelchairs will gradually <laughs> not be broken uh, that the staff will have different training or better training so that they can handle us and help us transfer to the aisle chair and all that kind of stuff. So, um, so this is my intent. This is my homework, per se, that I will look at the ACAA and do a video on that. And um, I'm giving you the homework to look at the ACAA as well so that when you fly, you, you have a good idea on um, what, what are the rights, you know, what protects you as a person with disabilities. And also um, the DOT put down some rights for people with disabilities who are traveling. So we will put that up as well. And um, I, I just hope that things go better. If, if there was a blip or something didn't work for you, you know, give the airlines feedback, give the airport feedback so that they're aware and they can work on improving. And if we, if we stay quiet and we don't say anything, then, you know, nothing will continue to improve. You know, they'll just do the minimal and then we'll be stuck. It, it just the minimal. So, so let's, let's help out. Let's help out. And I've, and I've said this before always important to give feedback so that we can work on making things better for for everyone so i will leave this video here uh consider reviewing the acaa uh, but i also will make a detailed video for sometime this week uh, so that you can take a look at that and your rights from the dot and we should be good. Um, if there are any questions or comments that you want to make in terms of your experiences flying, uh, you know, please put those down because it's it's good to look at all those all those positive situations that have occurred, and um, and that will encourage the rest of us. <laughs> so, all right, this is a brief uh, reflection on this. And uh, soon, hopefully, I'll, I'll put out the, the other video with details of the ACAA and your rights from the DOT. All right. Thank you. And I'll see you very soon. <laughs>